Where did he go? Where did... I'm so confused. He just ran. I just need to kill one of them, I think. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. You need to go. Oh! <laughs> Bloom with no healing? <laughs> but first, let's take a moment and enter into a mysterious world of dragons, tombs, and treasure. Thanks to the sponsor of today's video, Time Raiders. Time Raiders is an exciting MMORPG that takes you deep underground to solve ancient mysteries, fight supernatural creatures, and discover bountiful treasure. The culture and story of Time Raiders is shrouded in mystery. You might not even be able to trust your own memories. Choose from three unique classes, the Gunslinger, the Blade Master, and the Sage to start your adventure. Don't forget to customize your character to your liking with all sorts of hair, eye, and weapon colors, special outfits, facial features, and you can even have a pet. It's up to you to uncover clues to ancient legends, unearth long lost temples, and battle the supernatural that guards the treasures. Alongside the main quest, there are a lot of limited time events and daily challenges for PvP and PvE. Oh, oh god. Okay. Okay. Yeah, get my stuff. Get my stuff. Time Raiders also has an autoplay option, so you can advance in the game and watch one of my YouTube videos at the same time. Wait no longer and download Time Raiders today to become your own legend. Or get buried trying. Follow Time Raiders on all their socials right here and use the link in the description to download the game now. I really should learn how to use Bloom. I don't know why I have like almost no interest in playing Bloom or Hyper Bloom or anything like that. <laughs> Hyper Bloom is the easiest meta comp, but I'm just trying to figure out who then will I put on my Tignati team. I don't know if I could do like a full dendro situation on both sides. Nahida, Kuki, Ayato. And then on the flip would be what? Tignati, Yao Yao, Lisa, and Raiden maybe? Let me just workshop this a little bit. Great. I think my abyss teams are ready. <laughs> Off we go. Bow your head. Oh my gosh. Come a little closer. Hey! Urine. Oops, sorry. I'm so sorry. I was not aiming for that. Hyper Bloom is brain dead easy. This will be my first time hi trying Hyper Bloom Ayato. Is there like a standard rotation for it? Like which elements first? Or does it kind of not matter? It depends. It doesn't matter. I mean, it's probably all just going to be a jumbled mess by the end of it. So <laughs> I'll just do what feels natural. All right, let's do this. Ayato, Shinobu, yeah, Nahida, and Kazu. Tignani, Raiden, Yayo, and Lisa. Should be fun. I got Popeyes and now I'm having a heartburn. <laughs> uh, well, life is a series of choices and sometimes our choices don't yield the results that we hoped for. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that Popeyes was the wrong choice. Welcome to life. Hydro. <laughs> Hyper Bloom, I see it. Oh good, they're all Hydro uh, enemies. That's great. Gameplay, everyone. Ah, oh, damn. Our bond is strong. Hyper blooming circus. <laughs> I gotta. Oh, I got an achievement. First time. First. First time. Hyper bloomer. Not too More dendro. More dendro. More. <laughs> Using bandicam. No. Oh, you can't hide up there. Why are you so spread out, man? I love swirling nothing. Ow. Closer. <laughs> Why are they raised? Why are they on top of each other? I'm confused by this. Cannot switch characters now. I'll hate them and Shinobu go crazy, man. I'm so glad that Shinobu ended up getting her redemption after not too long. I remember just being so confused. Do you remember on the day that I that we pulled her? And I just, I was trying so hard to figure out <laughs> what is your purpose? Why do you have EM constellations and passives, and but then you scale with attack? And then what about electro damage bonus? We tried like four different builds on day one. <laughs> nothing, nothing worked. I remember the physical build. On day one of her release, Shinobu's best damage output was physical damage. <laughs> Gather round! I'm tired of your nonsense. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh. Uh, stop. I can't. <laughs> I 
<laughs> All right, that worked. Did you guys know that Joshua used to work in IT? And one of the first times we hung out, just the two of us, uh, we met at Starbucks and he, I got us both drinks and he looked at my laptop because I had spilled water on it and he was like investigating it. And I, what was the, there was like a part that we were playing. It's like a, I can't even remember, but that was one of the first times that we hung out, just the two of us, it was he was helping me with my computer, which he did successfully revive, by the way. If he didn't, I would have never, never dated him. <laughs> You know that, right? It's all about materials for me. It's all about electronics. The water bended. He water bended the water bottle. <laughs> water out. I'm a material girl. You knew you married a material girl. Yeah, when me and Joshua first met, or when we first like started talking, I was like really not in like a mental state to date because I had like just come out of a relationship and one that I thought was like gonna be the one and it definitely wasn't. And looking back, it would have been a disaster. But at the time, you know, in the in the depths of emotional woe, I couldn't see that clearly. But he was, Joshua was so patient with me and was content to pursue me, but still like, I don't know how he did it to be honest. He managed to like woo me without making me freak out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. He, he should have a masterclass on how to toe the line between friend and potential romantic significant other. I don't I don't know. It was, it was he did. He just yeah, he, he should have a Riz masterclass. Who is Joshua? That's my husband. My husband. Joshua did the boiling the frog in warm water thing. <laughs> oh, yeah. Have you guys heard that analogy? People use it for a bunch of things, but like basically if you put frogs in a pot and you slowly turn up the water, the frog won't notice that it's heating up until it's which is kind of morbid, but it, it gets the point across. What's that saying? I don't know what the saying is actually. Frog pot analogy? I don't think it's a saying. The premise is simple. If a frog is suddenly put into a hot of pot of boiling water, it will jump out and save itself from impending death. But if the frog is put in lukewarm water with the temperature rising slowly, it will not perceive any danger to itself and will be cooked to death. You know, considering the fact that my branding is fro all frog, that analogy fits morbidly but quite well dish emotes running away right now <laughs> it makes you think of that clip of the the crab who's like sliding into the pot the oil pot of oil thinking it's water i laughed and felt bad about it but some people it makes them really sad so i won't play it has it been tested i don't know i don't even know if it's true like i feel like at some point the frog would realize hey this pot is too hot and i'm no longer comfortable so i feel like it would still jump out so i don't know if that analogy is even accurate but anyway no more drama <laughs> Who's next? Who wants to be cooked? He let me cook. <laughs> ah, I don't have any dendro. It's okay. It'll just aggravate itself. So it tries to say that frog dies without noticing it dies. Yeah. Time to try it out. C cooking stream. <laughs> I feel like that falls into the animal cruelty. I wonder how that works. Obviously, I want, if you ask someone, hey, am I legally allowed to kill an animal on stream? I think the answer would be no. But then what if you're cooking a lobster? I hate the idea of cooking a, uh, cooking a lobster alive. Happy I think that's day. awful. But where's the line if it's for cooking? It's you technically right. kill the lobster first. To cooking live animals in general is very morbid. Yeah, I would agree with that. IDK, the ethics of culinary. I've seen people not kill the lobster before putting it in the water. Why would you unalive it live? Me, a vegan, can I leave now? <laughs> Sorry. I'm not a huge fan of shellfish, to be honest, just in general. I'm a shrimp auntie. In other news, I also enjoy um, grains. I like fruit. I really like carrots. I love bread. Bread. I don't think I could survive without bread. If I, w if I was diagnosed with a gluten allergy, I think I'd just die. Carrots, I love carrots. Although I have, I don't know if it's a pesticide pesticide allergy or if it's um allergy to carrots, but I can't eat carrots or broccoli raw. They have to be like steamed or cooked or something. It's easier the longer you have it, but I miss a baguette. I have a friend, Gabby was gluten-free. Like she had a horrible gluten allergy. She cut out gluten from her life for I think three years, like 100%, no gluten. And she, her body healed itself. She can eat gluten now with no problem. Actual Gabby W. That moment proved to me that she was just a superior human in general. Take this, that's yeah, yeah. If I can avoid getting hit, it might actually be worth it to use Lisa's E. No, no! I hate when it freaking targets the wrong one. Yes! Yes! 
<laughs> it's bouncing on his head! <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> okay, age. Okay, can I swirl Hydro? Yes. Yes, I can! Hey, squad! Boom, boom, ah. Stop. Oh my god, ow. Ow, 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 ow! Oh my gosh. I love that Tignati does a full spin move. He doesn't need to do that. He could just like, he could just do the thing. Just for the drama. Cascade. No, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to switch to Kasaha. Look at that Pee Wee damage. No. <laughs> My toad's broken. <laughs> Every time I go to flush it, it like takes a little bit more effort to flush, and it just barely flushes. But I keep not fixing it anyways um thoughts on lisa's outfit astounding remarkable incredible show-stopping game-changing tear-jerking masterpiece that answers your question maybe not game-changing um i say it's game-changing <laughs> no one can move <laughs> i don't know if you guys can see but the monolith is at a hundred percent later and 99%. It, it was nice while it lasted. No! Ah! No! Don't hit it. Hit me. Hit me instead. Hit me instead. Oh my gosh! Not that hard. Not that hard. One with the farts. One with the farts. Pepe out. Pepe out. Oh my! Hello, everyone. Who else wants some? Who wants the juice? Ah! Yeah, that was not worth. Not worth holding the E for. <laughs> It really does sound like he's saying but. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> I feel like that was kind of slow. I might need to do that again. 300 seconds? How many minutes is that? Oh my gosh, Dentro is kind of killing the. Holy crap, I didn't know Dentro was gonna do that so nicely. I didn't know that Dentro could shred Hydro Shields like that. Come along. I can't remember how to how to how to do this. Ah! Is it high is it Ah, here we go. I don't know if this team is quite working. Hurry up! All right, I was kind of, <laughs> it was like minimum performance, but <laughs> it worked, so let's move on. Boom! Boom! Ow, thank you for that. I, uh, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Oh, it's his back. <laughs> Stupid. Okay, next. Next. Hey, you can't put these to sleep? Oh, Electro, ah. Uh... Okay, Electro kind of copes. Okay, now it's not. Okay, next. Aye. Nice. Oh! No, 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 stop. Stomp your movements right this second. Oh my god. Okay, okay, this team might have not been ideal with the Electro situation. Let me use my burst. Let me use my burst. Any burst is fine. Ooh, I love all those little numbers. Ay, stop! Stop! Okay, alright. I'll take it. Next. So nice coming home to a dish stream in dish love. Ah! <gasps> stop. 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 <gasps> chill. 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 
<gasps> no, nah. I should just retry. Where did it go? Where did? I'm so confused. He just ran. <gasps> Stop! No! That's crazy. I just need to kill one of them. I think. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. You need to go. <gasps> oh my! <laughs> Ooh, he almost didn't make it. He almost didn't make it. That would I would have been so mad. Although I don't know if I can finish this chamber in time. We'll do our best. Ah! Stop! Stop! Oh! No! No! I should have done her E first! I'm so dumb! Okay. Alright, well, I'll continue. I don't know if I can do it without shinobu but i'll do my best chamber three no healing round oh right <laughs> let's snip that, that in the box quick healing quick healing quick healing uh first bunga bunga no dental reactions that's fine Okay, next side, no healing, no problem. Oh, I didn't even swirl anything, I'm so stupid. No healing. Oh, and I'm using Hyper Bloom, that's good. Oh! <laughs> no. Bloom with no healing? <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> Yeah, get it, I guess. This is <laughs> the oh. I gotta redo floor 12. Down. I just gotta pay better attention to the electro. Okay, so now we'd go. Nope. Dad, why do I keep doing that? <laughs> weak spot, weak spot, weak spot, again. Ah, oh, dang it. I timed that poorly. <laughs> chill, 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 chill. Okay, now we go. I meant to switch to Lisa. You know what? I should start over. <laughs> there we go. Ooh! You know what I'm struggling most with is cooldowns. Like, the cooldowns on this team is, like, not ideal. Oh my! Oh my! How did that shield break so quick? Oh my gosh. Whiff? Brain dead whiff? Okay. I think that went better than the first time. I already three starred the first two floors. Yeah. So it doesn't need to be perfect. It's just the perfectionist in me that wants to three to like have a pure 36 star run. <laughs> Uh, you know what I mean? Go, Lisa! Ow. Why are you so resistant to freaking Electro? <gasps> Dude! How do you... It's like impossible to avoid almost. I feel like I'm moving slower than normal. Oh, shoot. Not because I am moving slower than usual. Because <laughs> I don't have Yunjin. Everyone's alive. So, that's better than already. I mean, what? Better than last time. 
Give me my burst. Give me my burst. Give me my burst. Ah, oh, frick. Oh my gosh. I thought I was done. Stupid. Alright, minute and a half to clear the second half. Oh! Yes! Yes! And it's just like that easy! C6 Ayato, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. It was all skill. It's all skill and I'm a gamer. <laughs> and that's how I did that, of course. Pure skill, you guys won't understand. <laughs> Two years of Genshin gaming doesn't, doesn't just lead to nothing. Uh, it was a fun abyss. I think if I did not have C6 Ayata, I would have been crying, or I would have quit. <laughs> but I enjoyed it. <laughs> I aspire to be good like you one day. Thank you. Well, you can try. Uh, you can try, but some things are just, some qualities are just immutable. You can try all your life and you'll just never get there, but I wish you the best of luck. <laughs> that sounded so mean. You guys know about sarcasm, right? Please tell me. Please tell me that you know about sarcasm. Nope.